everyone, I'm Heather. I'm back for a really quick video. I think this one will hopefully actually be quick. Today's agenda is finding a new reading chair. I'm pretty excited about it. Um, I asked for a reading chair for Christmas for my husband. Um, but like, um, because it's something that requires like actual logistical sort of effort and planning and arranging and like going to a place and picking a thing and setting up a delivery time and then being home for a time and then squishing something through the door and then getting rid of something old like it's just beyond him really like I told him what I wanted for Christmas and he was like um do you just want a necklace <laughs> No, I don't just want a necklace. I think it feels sad that I'm not a person that likes, you know, like lotions and like jewelry and stuff. But anyway, it's a bit beyond him. It, he's still supposed to do it, but I'm just going to do it anyway because I want it now, not like three years from now. Um, and the state of our current reading chair. I'm going to show it to you now. Okay, look at this sorry piece of chair. Can we discuss it in detail? Like, it's so old. And disgusting. Um, Maisie has basically made it her own chair. Yeah, I see you, Maisie. I'm talking to you. That's your chair, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, so it's been here. Uh. <laughs> um, it's been here. Um, or with my husband. My husband's had this chair. He got it from a friend. Um, before we were married, and that's like 10 years ago now, like, we've been married like 10 years, so that was ages ago we got this chair used from a friend. Um, so it is seeing the end of its day, so I want to get a nice one, guys, like one where I can sit for ages and just read in peace, and like, I want it to be maybe like a colour, so like, um, I can feel cheerful, and like maybe a yellow color or something, just like a nice one. But also one um, that has structure. You know, my back hurts after a while. Um, I want to sit in it a while. Also, I want something maybe um, that I can put on it to keep the dogs out of the way. Like maybe a footstool or something that I can just put on it like when I leave it so that Maisie doesn't think it's hers. Um, and that's the goal for today. Are you excited? Go get a chair. I can help yeah. me pick one out. Yeah? Uh, so... Ariel Bassett, I'm going to put a video down below where she talks about the chair that she has and it is glorious and I love it. It's like blue and it's like old school and nice. Mom, what shall we put under magical chair What we are setting? I don't know, we'll have to go look. Um, but she said she got hers from Ikea and that's all fine but Ikea is so expensive and we'd have to drive there and we'd have to deal with all the bullshit of Ikea. Like, it's like a maze of horribleness. So, also... I have a lot of, like, excess guilt regarding my really disposable consumerist American childhood. Like, I feel like I need to spend the rest of my life making up for how much stuff I just purchased for a day and then threw away. Um, and just added to the, like, landfills of the planet and, like, the sea and was just really, like, wasteful. So, instead of going to Ikea, like I probably should do. I'm going to go instead to the British Heart Foundation. What? British Heart Foundation. Ooh, ooh, ooh. British Heart Foundation. Ooh, ooh. ooh. British Heart Foundation. <laughs> it is a charity shop or like a used we'll say charity that again. <laughs> furniture store. Um, that is what we're doing today. That's our journey for today. British Heart Foundation. Say ooh, it. ooh, ooh. Reading chair. Ooh, ooh, ooh. British Heart Foundation. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> um, if they don't have one there, um, I don't know, that's really my only plan. <laughs> uh, are we walking now? We're going to go get our chair. Yeah. It's such a nice day, isn't it? It's sunny. It's gorgeous. This chair. Okay, get, get off. Look, Edwin, this is a rocking chair. Oh, that's like a granddad's old computer chair. What about this one? Hey. Oh, well, we can't get a granddad's old computer chair at Tater Tot. I like this one. Lol. <laughs> 
Um, I like weirdly like this one, even though it's identical to something in my grandma's house. What do you think? Definitely not in the market for a furry rug, but oh, so nice. I think I saw this chair on that 70s show. Ooh, I love that. Oh, this is a good footstool. Hey, what about this chair, babes? What about these ones? They recline. Do you want to give it a try? What? Give those ones a try. Yeah, is it nice? Oh, sit on it. Okay, should I, should I have a go? And what about these ones? Oh, there where mommy sits, there where daddy sits, there where children sit. Oh, I love these ones. Are you going to give it a try? Sit in that one. No, not that one. That one. Give that one a sit. That one's a daddy. No. Too hard. Is it too hard? Yep. How about this guy? Ooh, mom, look at this one. Kind of beautiful. That mom, one. Look at this I kind of like this one. Mom, look at this pillow. Lol. It says reserved for men. Look on these guys. They're hideous 1970s recliners, but I just love them so much. Oh my How do gosh, you feel? Look at that one. Yeah. Are you sure we shouldn't get a rocking chair? I think Daddy would like this one. No. That was comfy. I can't feel it. Okay, babe, so it's between four, okay? So we need two of the four, okay? Got it? So this one is one. Yeah? Another one over here. This one. Yeah. Um, another one over here. This one. And then the other one over here, this rocking chair. What do you think? So that's your favorite, isn't it? Should we get that one? And we'll get a pillow to go on it? Yeah. Maisie definitely won't steal it. And then we need one other one. Maybe that white one? Yeah? we get for our rocking chair? This. The cat one? How about like the elephant one? But the cat one is so <gasps> Look at that hedgehog one! It says hedgehogs. Hedgehog. Or like the one with the dogs? Do you like that dog one? A dog? No. See the ones, the cute little wiener dogs? I know. Please, Your obsession with this weird 80s cat pillow is unsettling. Feel it with your hat. <laughs> so hideous 70s footstool. That's amazing. Okay. White bucket chair with pillow. Yeah. And then rocking chair. <laughs> okay. Chair success. Yeah? Do we pick yeah. out good ones? Yeah. Okay, so now they have to be delivered next Saturday, which I sort of anticipated. Uh, because they were like, oh so shall we deliver them Monday morning? No, I have to go to a job, unhappily. Uh, but, so next Saturday, Chair City Bitches. Also, this gives us time to call the council to collect a time, or to set up a time for them to collect our hideous other chair. Um, I'm not really gonna tell my husband that I'm taking away his chair. I'm just gonna put it outside with a collection date. And if he asks, I'll just say, it's, uh, it's obviously had its day, and now it has to go. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. I'd also like you all to know that I lost the battle about the cat pillow, and we got it for our rocking chair. Ta-da! Look how gorgeous it is! I mean, the cat, pi the cat pillow is, you know, uh, weird, but other than that, it's beautiful! It's in a sunny corner. It's perfect for reading. Oh, this is a perfect reading chair. This is actually the one that Anwen picked. So she can have a go on it. Ooh, she's gonna be excited. <laughs> it's moving. <laughs> Do you like your cat pillow? Yeah, it's quite a thought cozy. It's not cozy. Okay, you're that, I go. Yeah. 
Oh, it's kind of hot, but let me have a duck. This is the other one. Look how gorgeous it is. Look how gorgeous. Sunny corner, sunny corner. Beautiful. Um, however, it's got to share the space with the old one at the minute, unfortunately, because uh, the council sort of steered me a bit wrong and told me that I'd be able to get an appointment to get it taken away. <laughs> But then when I phoned again, they were like, no, you can't, you can't get it taken away till Wednesday. So I was like, well, it's Saturday. <laughs> okay. But anyway, whatever. So they're going to have to share that window um, f until Wednesday. But then that one will go away. The dog bed will go back down there. And then that one will be on the only window. Like the problem at the minute is that Alma can't get her toy cupboard open, which is going to be a problem. But basically, other than that, chair success. Oh my God, it's amazing. Or, is it like this? Oh my god. Perfect. Merry Christmas to me. Hey! Yeah! Do we have a good chair? Do you like this chair? Is this your favorite one? Yeah? Do you like our, our stool? Uh, you're doing a video again. Sorry. I'm just excited about the chairs. <laughs> you don't? Do you need a book to read in your chair? <laughs> it's a reading chair, you read in it.